guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be testing out some products from Beekman 1802. So if you wanna see how the products work, then just keep watching. So this is a skincare brand that is new to Ulta. I bought this gift set from them a couple of weeks ago. It's called the Skincare Star 7 Day Gift Set. It retails for $65. When I click on it though, it says, uh oh, something went wrong. So the product is not available anymore. Apparently this must have only been for Christmas and they must have sold out. So this specific set isn't available however these products are still available because they were just products in their line that they created a set to make it easier so products are still available this specific set isn't okay they do have some sets so i'll link all the products down below but they do have one set still called the milk probiotic skincare starter kit and it comes with four items, whereas this comes with seven. So it is a little bit smaller for $59. So I'll link that one down as well, but then I'll link the full size of each one of these products and I'll, um, I'll tell you the prices, I'll keep this open. So let's just go through this step by step. So like I said, we have seven products that it comes with. I'm gonna pull up the website as we talk so I can explain the products. So let's start off with the Buttermilk Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. The original size retails for $38. Um, I'm just gonna read off of Alta's website. It is supposed to be a deep cleanse without irritation, irritants or sensitizers, effective enough to remove water-resistant makeup and leave skin instantly nourished for a healthy complexion. Okay, next, I'm just kinda gonna go step by step of how this box recommends it. So it first says to do that and then to cleanse with the Milk Wash Exfoliating Jelly Cleanser. This is my little baby size. Okay, so the original size retails for $38. Actually, it looks like you get a lot just from looking off of the image on their website. Does it say five ounces? Wow, that's actually quite a bit. Um, so the, the key benefits is to remove the makeup, including water-resistant formulas. It deep cleanses and exfoliates for clearer, brighter skin. Helps control oily skin, clears pores, and fights blemishes. I'm just gonna read the key benefits of these or we'd be here all day. Um, next, treat your skin with the mud, the clay mask. Okay. This is the one product that we're probably not gonna use today. Um, I will use it by the time that I post this, so I'll just let you know my thoughts down below. But it is the Milk Mud Warming Clay Mask. This one retails for $38. There's also a small sample size of this and a bubble mask for $25. It's like a ornament duo. So I'll link that if you wanna just try this instead of buying the full. So the benefits of this is to instantly purify and minimize pores, instantly exfoliates for the perfect canvas day or night or for a special occasion, helps control oily skin, clears pores to say goodbye to bad skin days, and shimmering earth minerals leave skin with a soft focus finish and adds a touch of sparkle. So far, the first couple of items, it keeps mentioning oily skin. So I wonder if this brand is geared towards oily skin which i'm not i'm dry but that's what it's sounding like all right what's next so you either use the mask or we got a ghost something moved in here so you can use the clay mask or the milk foam calming bubble mask and that's also then that what that duo is it gives you both masks so here's my calming bubble mask that one is $40, so it's actually a little bit more, a couple dollars more. This one is supposed to instantly calm and cool skin, instantly soothes redness and plumps, instantly plumps and perfects. I need help with redness, so that would be nice. So it's supposed to give you calm, clear, and moisturized skin. That sounds like my cup of tea. So after that, it suggests to layer on the dewy eye serum. Just little baby, he's so cute. I love tiny things. Ooh, I just saw in here they have a probiotic lip serum. I love the applicator it comes with. Okay, we're getting distracted. They do have some travel size stuff on here if you want it. Whoa, baby. That's expensive. So the full size of this, which is only 0.5 fluid ounces, which for eye serum, you don't need a lot. 
This comes with 1.6, or I mean, sorry, 0.16 fluid ounces. So 0.5 fluid ounces is $42. Beach. It's supposed to instantly cool and awaken dull skin, fights dark circles and deep puffs, and then lifts and smooths fine lines and wrinkles. So the next thing it suggests to do is the Milk Drops Probiotic Ceramide Serum. This retails for $45 for the full size. Keep trying to emphasize this. This is not full size. The benefits. Transform skin with from within in just one drop. Damn, that's a big claim. Instantly delivers moisture beyond the surface. Your skin just drinks it in. I need that. Restore skin's healthy hydration for a more youthful appearance, helps control oily skin, clear pores, and balance, balances discoloration, and then boosts skin health and fights dullness. Again, something about oily skin. All right, the last thing is the Bloom Cream Probiotic Moisturizer. Woo! The original size is $54. Very sporadic in pricing. It feels like. All right, key benefits. Instantly delivers moisture beyond the surface for petal soft skin. Restores skin healthy hydration for a more youthful appearance. Helps control oily skin and keeps skin balanced. Again, oily. Uh, boosts skin health and fights dullness for blooming radiance. So again, oily. So it sounds like this line is definitely geared towards oily skin, which I am not. So we'll see how this works out for me. Let's go ahead and just jump in. So the first thing we're gonna do is use the Milk Up Makeup Milk Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. So it literally is just a balm, so that's pretty hard. So it does not give you anything to scoop. So I'm just gonna get my nail in there. Might be too much, but whatever. Oh wow. That was Fast. I need more. I think you're supposed to technically use a balm and add a little bit of water. I never have. Let me know. Is that what you're supposed to really do? <laughs> Since we're just sitting at my vanity, I am going to use wipes, face wipes, to take the rest of this off. Normally, you're supposed to just, you know, use water to get it off. But, like I said, we're sitting here at my vanity. So, I have just Costco wipes that I'm going to use. Okay, we are makeup free, supposedly. I will say out of every, hold on, I'm overexposed now because I'm so pale. <laughs> oh, I can't grab it, my hand's too slick. There, maybe we'll just, that works. Okay, I will say out of the cleansing balms I've used, this one probably has to be one of the ones that affect my eyes the least. Oh, those wipes get me though. A lot of cleansing balms sting my eyes, and this one really did not. Okay, let's go on with the next product, which is the Exfoliating Jelly Cleanser. It says apply one to two pumps to dry skin, gently massage onto face, add water to emulsify into a milky cleanser. Okay, so I'm going to apply this. I have some water. I'm going to apply a little bit of water, and then I'm going to hop to my sink real quick to rinse it off. So let's try this out. So what did it say? Two pump, one to two pumps. So weird that you do it dry. Okay. And then add water. Okay. Just add a little water. Or a lot. Okay. I mean, it feels good. Okay, I'm gonna go wash this off. I'm gonna do the bubble mask, but I'm actually going to do this later from when I'm filming now because you have to let it sit for 15 to 20 minutes. So it says to, on dry skin, pump a palm full of product. Wow, that's a lot. And apply evenly over the face, let bubble, let mask sit for 12 15 to 20 minutes then rinse with lukewarm water and pat dry so i'm actually going to do that a different time all right fuck it let's just do it now okay let's go ahead and go in with the calming bubble mask it says to let sit for 15 to 20 minutes for the purpose of this i'm not going to unless we have to whoa it's already starting to bubble i haven't washed my hand yet and it's already starting to bubble. Oh! 
I feel it on my nose. We're gonna let this sit for, it says 15 to 20 minutes. And I'll be right back when I can rinse this off. So that bubble mask is off now. That really helped my nose. Like it doesn't feel as dry now. That's awesome. Okay, let's move on. So the next one is the Dewy Eye Illuminating Serum. Apply a pea size amount under the eyelid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little bit of that on the eye. I do it on top too. Do you guys? So, so far so good. That feels really, really nice. All right, we'll move on to the next thing, which is the Probiotic Ceramide Serum. Apply a few drops directly to the skin. Okay, doesn't say how many, just says a few. We'll call that a few. Oh my God. This feels amazing. Might have applied too much though wow it wasn't kidding though your skin soaks that right up wow okay so that felt great all right last thing this is the blood cream probiotic moisturizer directions apply a pea size twice daily okay a pea a pea size okay Okay, so that is all of the products. Let's talk about them really quick. Um, I feel like because there's seven products, I want to speed through because I don't want this video to be too long. The melting balm, I think, was really nice. I liked the fact that it didn't really sting my eyes, and a lot of balms do. So I think that was really nice. I did notice I got my makeup off really fast as well. The jelly cleanser, same thing. It felt really nice, honestly. I don't think it really did the milky cleansing part, but I probably needed more water because I mean, I literally just had a little bit left in this. <laughs> so this one I'm definitely gonna have to give a go again. Obviously the milk mud, I didn't use it right now. I'll tell you my thoughts about this in the description. Uh, the calming bubble mask is just one of those things that it's a cool effect. It does the bubbling effect, which just always feels weird to have it tingle on your skin, but I did like the feeling of it afterwards, so I definitely think it worked. I, I mean, obviously these kind of things are things you notice over time, but immediate thoughts that it felt really nice, um, especially in my nose, which is my really dry area. The under eyes, it felt nice. Again, it's one of those things that you have to use over time to really know if it's gonna work. But immediate thoughts, immediate thoughts, it seemed to do a little like cooling effect. It felt nice when I applied it. It's pretty sticky now though. Like my eyelids feel sticky. So either it's the product or I put too much on. <laughs> uh, next, I love this. Um, it's the Milk Drops Probiotic Ceramide Serum. Obviously I don't know if it really works yet, but I can tell you first impression, it felt awesome it really really felt moisturizing and it definitely felt like it sunk just like right into my skin um, and then I do really actually like the cream too I don't know if it's the combination of the two because this said to only use a pea size and I felt like that actually went a long way which normally I feel like it doesn't on me so I don't know if it's the combination of the two together of why this worked so well but I really really like this add it all seven if i had to say pick one to change your re current routine to and use this it's probably gonna be the probiotic ceramide serum but again it obviously depends on your skin type i'm very dry especially in the winter so for me this is the one thing that i would for sure say pick up but yeah that is all um of the products like i said the only thing i didn't try on camera is the calming mud so i will link it down below or link it down below i will say in the description box down below how that worked for me but other than that i am pleasantly surprised with this brand like i said it's probably geared towards oily skin it sounded like but these moisturizing parts at the end i really really liked so yeah that is all i have for this video so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next one